everybody. Happy, happy Monday. Happy Monday. It is Monday. New day, new week, new beginnings, new everything, right? Whatever happened last week, over the weekend, forget it. Today's a new day. We're going to get crafty. We're going to have some fun. We're going to forget all the troubles in the world and we're just going to have a good time for a little while. Okay, so come on in, hang out, say hi once you are here. Tim, I'm Christy with Christy's Craft Room. I'm not. That's Tim. He's hanging out with us and he is sending out the text message. If you would like to get text messages when we go live, just text hello to this phone number right here, right here, grab a screenshot, and we will send you a text message when we are live so you don't have to rely on the notifications on social media. You'll get them right from, right from Tim and I. Hello, Miss Shirley. Hello, Carrie and Gail. How are you? I see Brandy. How are you, my friend? Hello, Melissa. Hello, Dabby. Happy Monday. Happy Monday, Miss Tina, Miss Kathy, Misty, and Patricia. Hello, hello, Miss Candace. All right, I'm going to get rid of this and put it back over here, over here. And we're going to craft, y'all. We're going to make a little bit of a bang. I make a bang in the craft room, okay? I got these. You guys were shopping with me when I got these at Dollar Tree, I don't know, a month or so ago. And we are going to... Um, we're gonna craft with them. I had an idea when I saw them. I was like, what would you do with these? But then I came up with an idea with y'all live. And we're gonna do it today. We're gonna do it today. And I have extras that I probably don't need. So I'm going to gift whatever I use Thank today. Thank you, for the stars. Whatever I use today, I'm gonna throw into a box and gift it to somebody who's hanging out here with us. So you're gonna not only get ooh, these ooh. foam things, but Welcome, you're gonna get- Tammy. Whatever embellishments I use, I'll send you. Hopefully, I have doubles. Thank I'll you, Lindy, for the stars. You'll get some of everything I use. Okay, there is a star party going on. Oh, star party. It's going star on. Star party, star party. Woo, star party, star party, star party. Woo, Miss Pam got the text message. Thank yes, you, Kimberly, for the did. stars. Awesome, awesome. And there we, uh, uh, welcome to Tammy and any other newbies that we have. If, welcome, if, welcome. If you are new here, welcome. I hope Thank you, you enjoy Lenny it. Thank you, Lenny Lovata, for the stars. If you do, click the little follow button. Thank you, so Katie, for the stars. Facebook will see more of it. You're going to find Thank out. Thank you, Susan, for the stars. We just try to keep things real here. We are just regular old people. We interrupt each other. We talk over each other. We sometimes sort out the marital things here, right here live. Sometimes we ask y'all what you think, and um, we, we get your opinion. Um, Thank you, Nicole and Teresa, for the stars. Sometimes yeah, you side usually with him. Yeah, you so say, I'm wrong. Not usually. Actually, usually they Take pick kids when I'm stars. like, who did it better, him or her? Usually he gets the votes, y'all. Yes. Miss Carrie, thank you for the stars. You didn't get the text message. Oh, no, Becca. If for some reason your text message ever quits working, just text hello to that number again, and it should get it started. If it still Thank doesn't work, text stop to that number, and then text start, and that will reset things for you, okay? We are crafting some firecrackers, y'all. Firecrackers. So we have our Thank you, Marilyn, for phone. the stars. We have a bunch of random. I got some fabric. I've got some brick, brick, brick rack. Holy cow. Brick rack. Did we eat? Thank we, you, Cindy. Miss Cindy, look at those stars, girlfriend. And thank you, Billy. We achieved and the star Delta party. For the stars? Holy we cow, We achieved you guys are the awesome. star party. Star party. Star party. Star party. Thank Woo! you, Nana, for the stars. Star party. Banana? Nana. Oh. Nana no. okay. <laughs> it sounds like you said thank you, banana, some. for the stars. I'm like, banana. I've seen no, some. Nana. I've seen some unusual Facebook okay. names, but I've never seen someone's name banana. Okay, so Nana, are you. Lori's Nana? Could Lori Newell's Nana Newell? Nana Newell? Oh, he knows someone with that last name. Yes, I do. Are you related Thank to Lori? Are you her Nana or her mama? Thank maybe you, even? Uh, Crystal? No, I, I don't know because she All calls right. her mom by her mom's name and I don't remember what it We're is. We're going to cut three pieces at three different lengths. I'm using my handy dandy little Fiskars um, cutting tool here. Oh. Um, and I know someone's going to ask, because every time I use this, people ask. Tim, you, I think I have the link in our list, link list. He can grab it for you if you want to check it out. Oh, gosh. I'm not oh, measuring. I'm just kind of eyeballing. There it is. Uh, I will tell you how long it ends up being oh. in the end, but I think I'm going to go about that long. I'm guessing it's about five-ish inch, ish, ish inches. Ish? Ish. Um, I could be way off. 
You kind of roll it okay. and look how nice it cuts it like a butter. It just cuts right through, cuts right through. My next one, I'm gonna cut a little bit shorter, a wee bit shorter, like an inch ish. Did inch, you say, inch ish ish ish? Shorter. Did you say where you got the twine? The twine I got at Michael's. I actually got it last year on clearance after patriotic season. So they probably have it. They usually do have this um, colored twine. Missy says you should use your new tape measure. Oh, yes. Where is it? It's on the kitchen table. It didn't get put away yet. Um, but Tim can grab it if he'd like to. This twine, you always find the colorful holiday themed or season themed twine on little end caps at Michael's. It's $3.99, but you always get it when it's like 40% off. And... Um, I got these last year 90% off at the end of the season. So check your Michaels, check your Michaels. I love the ish measuring. I know, Diana, sometimes you just got to go with the ish, okay? All right, so you just want each to be, now see these two ended up being the same size, so I need to cut a little bit off of this one. Yeah, so we're going to cut about an inch ish, ish, and just make a little baby one here off of this one. There. Trying to cut it straight. Oh, oh. The firecrackers aren't perfect. You all right there? Yeah, it's on the corner of that. He likes to find the desk. corners, y'all. Oh, thank he you, Billy for the stars. Oh, my goodness. Thank you, Miss Billy. Ooh. Hello from Brownstown. Brown's 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 Town. Brown's Town. I know where that's at. All right, get rid of my mess. Sweep it on the floor. It'll get, I don't know, maybe the cleaning fairy will come. What are the, oh. This girl. <laughs> Eventually. Yeah, the cleaning fairy. She fairy. comes once every... I don't know. Not often so enough. Awesome. Not often enough. Let me put this away into my little protective shield. Protective shield. Did you find? Did they have this link in the thing? Yeah. Oh, did good. you pin it? I didn't pin it. Because it scrolls by and then you can't find it. I'll right. pin it for I'll you. Pin it. Or just paste it again and pin it. Instead of going on the hunt. Mm, Would work too. Hello, Miss Sandy Smith. How are you? Peace. Just got the text, but I seen you before the text. Sheila, I'm glad you got the text though. All right, so we have a little cluster, okay? So each one is higher. Now, I, I'm doing patriotic and firecrackers, but you could totally turn this into like a little nautical, paint these to look like wood and make like a little a nautical pillars Thank for you, your Rose tiered Mary tray. For that would be super, super cute, but we're not doing that today. It's Maybe spinning. another day. All right, um, it's pinned. But someone who sprinkles this video is going to get these supplies, and you could always go that route if you didn't want to do patriotic. Thank so you, you're Marcel, get for the stars. A whole brand new one of these, and then whatever Hi, else Tammy. I use. Not the paint, though. I can't send the paint. Can't send the paint. You have two welts on your shin from the dishwasher door being opened. Tim's too busy eating pickles over here. Sorry. To monitor the comment section. Dishwasher door being opened and one uh, open and one on my thigh from my desk. I'm a klutz. You and Tim both need the bubble wrap. Well, see, the bubble this wrap. is for my hair. Okay, see, this is my chair. Because I sit, I don't stand like her. And he has to swing his leg wide when he gets on. And, and he swings it into the corner of the desk. Yeah, and this desk has two two shelves, uh, two drawers underneath of it. And the side of those drawers, catch it every time. Every time. Right every in the time. kneecap. So I am painting these. This happens to be chalk paint. I My red paint is acrylic paint, and I'll let y'all know how it oh. works. I'm okay. I will probably gonna distress it a little bit, so I'm okay if I don't paint it perfectly. Well, you have to dance too. Is it dancing time? Yes. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me yeah, put my dance. firecracker down. Hope it doesn't spill. Have to dance. Dancing time. Dancing time. time. Y'all, I've been trying to tan my chicken wings for you, so I don't blind you. I've been, at the, yeah. I've been like this. Oh look, yeah. see, yeah, see, I'm getting there. She's been tanning. I got a little red yesterday. I've been tanning. I know. This is this is me at all the track meets. And I have this like pole that I have to like when we're helping with the track meet that I have to hold. You know, you know how it is when you are like such a bad angle. I know. Okay, chicken wings. I got the chicken wings, y'all. That's one thing my body's not missing is some chicken wings. Um, I like but you know how wings. when you are at a um, outdoor event and you get a lot of sun, you end up with the white marks right here because you have your elbows bent so so no sun gets in there and then the inside is like white so we have this like thank you Lorraine, for the stars that we use to put the pole up when it's really high so i was like standing there holding it like strategically holding it out like this with the sun trying to get the inside of my arm okay yeah it didn't work too well 
didn't work too well. And I know some of y'all are like too much information. What is this girl talking about? Get to crafting, get to crafting, quit talking about your arm fat. Um, well, guess what? We embrace it all here. Okay. Arm fat and all <laughs> we like, to, we prefer to call it our chicken wings though. Okay. Okay. We got big chicken wings here, like the big beefy chicken, not the little wimpy little and niblets. I, I like chicken wings. Tim likes chicken wings. I like chicken wings. Tim's a fan of chicken wings, so um, it's all good around here. We embrace them. We embrace them because it's just part of life. It's part of getting older. It's a part of who we are. It's part of... Um, well, shut up. You ain't that old. I'm getting there. Uh, you got a long way I'm to getting up. there. I'm getting there. All right, so there's our blue one. Okay, this is this is styrofoam we got from the Dollar Tree. Yep, they're little from, foam rods. From the buck and a quarter store. This is exactly how they came from Dollar Tree. And they're like a really, really firm foam. They're not like the crackly stuff that you like stick your floral arrangements into. It's really, really stiff. We need to smile daily and you do that. Aw, thank you. Thank you, Miss Hannah. <laughs> I'm happy to hear that. Miss Hannah. Don't laugh at yourself, laugh at me. So you don't have to laugh at yourself or anybody else. Laugh at me. I'm okay with that. <laughs> Honestly, I'm okay with I that. have turkey wings, still good. Turkey wings, yeah, it's a good old turkey wing. Oh yeah, yeah, some of us have turkey wings. Um, mine are borderlining turkey wings. I don't know, maybe they are turkey wings, but I don't know. Depends like, on who you ask, I, I guess. I like that you're not afraid of showing us your chicken wings. Y'all, listen, listen, let's be real here, okay? I got the chicken wings, I got the muffin top, I got the thunder thigh, I got the trunk full, I've got it all, okay? I got it all, and I just, it, it, it is what it is. I, all right. I, I like chicken thighs, too. I think I'm gonna do your what? Oh. Thank you, ready for the stars. He likes his chicken thighs, too, he says. Yes. I like chicken thighs. Yes, yes. He says he doesn't get the perks working around here. He gets to work with the chicken thigh girl. Turkey thighs, probably more like turkey thighs. I don't know. Listen, that's the thing. Like we're like all of us, you, us. Listen, none of us are perfect. We've got all the things, all the things. I'm pretty close. Okay. I saw a post not too long ago and it showed these girls like with these like poses all like perfect. And then it showed them like just relax. And it was like a completely, it looked like they had liposuction and all the, the surgeries, but it's just because the angles and how they sucked it up. We can't walk around like that all day long. We can try, but it doesn't look very natural, okay? It doesn't look very natural, okay? Um, just saying, just saying. I would probably get some crazy looks. <laughs> No, uh, no, no, Don. <laughs> There's some who do walk around like that. I'm not, not perfect, cute, but, but I'm pretty close. I'm pretty close. <laughs> I'm not perfect, but I am pretty close. Tim's not perfect, but he I'm embraces close. the imperfections. Thank you, Susan, for the stars. And that's even better. That's even better, right? He embraces my imperfections, and that's okay. That's okay. All right, so I'm painting this red. We're going to add <laughs> some fun little... Jackie says some of us have buffalo wings. Buffalo wings. <laughs> you spicy girl. Spicy with those buffalo wings. Yes. All right. You may need a second coat depending on your paint. I don't know. One coat is doing pretty good. I find anytime you use red over top of white, you almost always need a second coat because it tries to get like a little bit of a pink hue if you don't do a second coat. Um, oh, the turkey gobbler. Yes. Yes. What was that called? Yes, you gotta get the what's, angles right for that. You gotta walk around like this to hide the turkey gobbler so nobody sees what's it. What's it called? Stretch it. The wat waddle? What waddle? The, the, the oh, a waddle. A wat 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 wat. What, a wat 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 wat. It's called a waddle. Down the wah -wah. It's a waddle. A, a waddle. A waddle. This thing is called the waddle. Snow. And this is called the noddle or something like that, I think. I looked it up one time. Do you think I remember that? I looked no. it up because we were doing a craft. And I wanted to know, and I wanted to, I wanted to, I wanted to like, I wanted to know. I wanted y'all to know that I know. Thank you, Lori, for the stars. I don't know it anymore, though. I forgot it. <laughs> That's the problem. Marcel said, thanks for making me s smile, a bit stressed out with my father who's showing signs of dementia. Oh, oh. who is that? Uh, Marcel. Marcel. Marcel, listen, I get it. I get it. Ooh. I get it. That's. 
embrace him and love him right where he's at. Okay? So Missy says, if you lift your arms high, no chicken wings or muffin top. Look up with your okay. look up with your tongue at the top of your mouth. No chicken neck. <laughs> no, that doesn't look weird at all. Walking around that, like that. And this is every time you're like, wow, she's a Jesus praise Jesus. People like praise Jesus, praise Jesus. That's what I just. You just gotta walk around like that all the time. All the time. She's gonna be like, well, she's one Jesus freak. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am, I am. <laughs> you wouldn't have chicken wings because you would be building those muscles, holding them up all the time. You probably wouldn't end up with chicken wings anymore and you couldn't eat anything. Okay, guys, <laughs> I'm gonna grab some names here. Good in a diet second. plan. Good diet plan. Oh my gosh, y'all. The things society makes us do, right? Right. Well, thank you, Laura. She says, I've been so stressed. I get my brain Great. scan results tomorrow. You guys keep me distracted. Uh, good. Well, prayers for good, good, good results good. Um, and the information that's needed that you get answers. Okay. We have. What? 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 I know, right? What? what? Cynthia Street, Kimberly Farnsworth, Mary Miller, Tiffany Shield. Patricia Sawyer Allman, Kathy Lobenstein Pierce, Michelle Knott, Lynn Coe, Missy Hubbard, Lori Thomas, Becca Maggie, Cynthia Street, and Pam Cooper O'Brien. We're just going to add a little bit of a. Oh, goodness gracious, come on, come on. I know you're in there, I feel you. There you are. Thank you, Lois, for the stars. I feel you, I know you're there. All right. Thank you, Sony, for the stars. Throw in a little bit of a second coat. Tim is dying over there. I don't know what he just read, but he is dying over there. Oh, mosquito service on May 19th. Yes. Oh, was yes. it? Okay, good. We're coming May 19th. Whoop, whoop, when is that? That's Three like days. in a couple days. Three days, right. Mosquitoes, it. just Perfect. in time. Mosquito season is coming. They just started coming out. We're getting our mosquito spray. Yes, we need that. What are you giggling over there about, Tim? You sound like a... Thank you, Becky, for the stars. Oh, no. Boy, mm -hmm. you're peeking at nope. something you shouldn't be peeking at. Nope. Uh, Virginia, that's not what she was doing. Oh, I am not by any, no, no, I am not, I am not, no. And I know you're just asking, you're probably, and I hope I didn't offend anyone just now. I am not making fun of Jesus. I am literally a Jesus freak. Okay, I love Jesus. Um, no, not at all, not at all. And I certainly hope nobody was offended by that or took it that way. Um, Thank you, Stephanie, for the stars. No, no. So, no. Just having fun, just having fun. Jesus has a sense of humor, too. He does. Look at me, I'm proof. I know, he made all of us. You know he had a sense of humor. Think of all the noises and the things that come out of our bodies. I mean, don't tell me he didn't have a sense of humor, okay? Mm. He's like, ha, ha, let me add that feature. Ooh, let me make that squeaky noise. Ha! Ooh, let me add this funky color to that and see what they say. Um, yes. Yeah. <laughs> the platypus. Case in point. <laughs> yes. The platypus. It's, it's a humorous world we live in, and, and I think Jesus was a humorous um, pers person. He was. He was. God was humorous. He had, God had a sense of humor. Yes. Absolutely. So Tim, those um, names you just called were one after another in the comment section. Is that how it is done? Just wondering. He takes screenshots of the comment section. Sometimes they go like, and he gets the screenshots fast. It depends on how fast the comments are rolling. So sometimes they will all end up bam, 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 bam. Sometimes there might be a name missing here or there in between the list. Um, that's just because a name slipped by when he was taking the screenshots and he missed that name. It's completely random. Um, of how that works. So, so if they were all like showing in a line, he just takes a bunch of screenshots, run one after another, and reads those names that are in the screenshots that he took. So usually the names are a little bit further back than um, you know, right before he's actually saying the names. 
Yeah, I know the mosquitoes are coming. They just, I just saw, I think, my first, like, mosquito. Well, um, yesterday was, started seeing them. When I was adding the chemicals to the pool, there was a Today. bunch of them, kind of, no, uh, it was Saturday. Oh, there yeah. There was a bunch of them flying around the Well, I'm sure they were probably having a good old time in our swamp pool, you know. You know how the pools get? We're, we just, we're opening our pool. We always open our pool a little bit on the early side here for Michigan because Elena's birthday is next weekend and she likes the pool open for her birthday. It's freezing cold still, but she likes it open. Thank you. I know most of you guys understand that, but some people are new here and they don't know me that well to know that I would not do make fun Thank of Thank you, Jesus. Tammy and Tracy for the stars. Um, but most of you know. You saw a lightning bug last night for the first time in Florida. That is so awesome. Did you know, fun fact about lightning bugs, I love lightning bugs. We used to we used to go and catch them and put them in a jar and put them in our tent when we were little. We'd love them. We'd wake up more than they'd all be dead. Um, sorry to the lightning bug population. The what? <laughs> we, we personally impacted the lightning bug population. But did you know that lightning bugs, when they light up, that is how they communicate? That is how they communicate. They light, they like blink their little light butts at each other. Thank you, Donnie, for the stars. To communicate. So. Um, uh, these are just the foam, just a foam stick. Just, it's just, from, it's from the bucket and quarter store. Just like that. And it's like a, like a hard foam, a hard foam. And I'm going to send this, the supplies I'm using today, I'm going to send Christmas to someone stars. today. Someone who sprinkles. Okay? And now, um, oh. now I know this is already white, but it's like foamy white. Patty. And it has that weird sheen, so I'm going to hit it with some white paint just to like give it the same texture, and kind of flatten the sheen a little bit. But Patty, no, we we don't have a heater for our pool. We just use the sun. No, good old sun, good old sun power. I'd love a heater for our pool, but no, we did actually just take down. We had three trees you, that Teresa, were like a cluster that shadowed the pool for about half the. Thank you, Karen. Half the days worth of the stars. sun. So I'm hoping it gets a little bit warmer. It'll get a little bit more sunshine during the day now. Thank you, Jenny, for the stars. Because it's usually too cold for me. Yeah. It, we have to be like in the 90s for a good solid week before it's warm enough for me to. Yes, we need a we we need uh we need a pool warmer for her to use it. Thank you, Candace and Joyce for the stars. But I'm hopeful now because we've got more. It gets more sun now. More sun. It'll it'll stay warmer. Yeah, it doesn't... Because it used to get sun just in the afternoon. So now it'll get it almost all day. Yes, Tiffany, the firecracker arrow. Yes, that video I posted. Um, You guys, check it out if you haven't. Using she the was arrows. looking for that. The arrows, I was. I had an idea. The Thank arrows the stars. that I got from Dollar Tree, the little wooden arrows. We made fire, a firecracker out of it last year. Kind of like a rocket-looking firecracker. And um, I had a plan. I was going to make another one to pair with it, but I was going to do it differently. And you guys, I can't find my firecracker. I was like, I didn't think, I was like, I don't know. Maybe I sold it in the auction. I didn't think I did. But now I'm wondering if maybe I sold it in the last auction. Thank you, Marla, for the stars. No, she didn't make her the shirts. The, well, these I had ordered from someone a long time ago when I first started. The idea of laying black, gar black garbage bags on top of the water. Has anyone tried that? Candace, I don't know. Have I've, you tried I've heard it? of it. But I've heard of it, but I haven't tried it. Some people say it like that it works. I don't know. And it's, we did have if a... If it works, I'll just get a black tarp and throw on there every day for a couple hours. We did have a... Uh, uh, the solar cover for it but we never used it we're we not good at it. that like you're supposed to put the solar cover on at night and um and take it off in the morning yeah it's like a blanket it helps keep the heat in because that's when your pool, pool gets cold is the cold nights we have it all that heat escapes um yeah we weren't good at using the solar blanket and it, it kind of got a little dry rotted, so we were like, man, eh, whatever. We kind of had to get rid of it. So, all right, we've got all of our firecrackers painted. Now, my decision, my decision, my decision, my decision. It's decision time, y'all. It's decision time. Uh-oh. Do I... Yeah, they need a little something. Thank you, Andrea. We're going to add a little embellishing, okay? So, we're going to... 
Get ready, guys. I'm going to uh, get some more names here in a minute. Add some white stripes. Let me shake this up so I can use the lid. Karen, I know it's hard to remember. It's like you have so many things to do in a day. The last thing you're thinking of at the end of the day is to go out and put a little blankie on the pool. Yeah. Thank you, Carla, for the stars. No, it's uh, it's an above ground pool. So I'm just doing just a very rough, nothing fancy. Uh, yeah, Jenny, we did send out the text message today. We did. If you didn't get it, text stop and then start. And that should reset the texting for you. So you should get the messages in the future. Okay, and uh, I'm going to grab some names here in a second. All right, so we're just doing, like, nothing fancy, not perfect, like, a shaky hands, eyeballs that need um, reading glasses, yeah. so everything looks like it's squiggly and moving on you when you're doing it. It's getting worse and worse. i got to hold it a mile away from my face to Where's see what I'm doing. Where's your reading glasses? They're out, in the, out um, on my desk. Mm -hmm. I, the only reason, the, the reading glasses, please tell me, y'all, like, how did you get yourself adjusted to reading glasses? Because the problem is, this is focused, but then everything else back there is really blurry, and it, like, it's weird to me. It's weird, and it's, like, it's weird, and it kind of gives me a little bit of a headache. Okay. So, I don't know. Tell me your thoughts on when you first we, got reading glasses. We have Virginia Goodart Hensley, Trudy Fall. Christine, Christine Van Cleve, Delta D. Thompson, Patricia Sawyer Allman, Verdi Winters, Cynthia Street, Janine Warren, Linda Bub Spare, and Hannah Filer Blackman. I do, Hannah. I need some glasses, girl. I do. She does. I actually have reading glasses. I did get a like a prescription from the eye doctor, and then I just went and bought that <laughs> prescription. Debbie says, I would love to have a pool for the five days a year. We need it here in Western Washington. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. I know. I know. We The kids used the pool a lot when we first got it. They don't use it as much anymore, and it's kind of they were getting to that weird stage where they kind of use it, they don't use it. It's one of those... We put a lot of money into it every year to keep it up and going and to keep it clean and fresh and a lot of work. Three times last year. And they don't use it enough. Trevor Trevor used it a lot more last year. <laughs> Elena, a few times with her friends. The problem is it's too cold. It's too cold. So then mm -hmm. like get in for five minutes and then they're out. So hopefully it'll be warmer this year. All right, so we got a little they're stripes. Working good for them. Maybe you need bifocals. Well, I have contacts. Well, yeah, because you can get one for close and one for far. But I have contacts. Yeah. No, no, I'm not that. I'm, a, I'm looking far away. I can't close this eye at all. Like this one, I do that weird, y'all know, link, link. This one, I can't. <laughs> that one, I can't close at all. <laughs> at all, okay? Yeah. So, um, yeah, that wouldn't work well for me. That wouldn't, I don't think that would work for me. Sometimes, for weirdly, the texting will be delayed. I don't know. All right, I'm just going to do some polka dots. Some polka dots, some polka dots, some polka dots on our big one here. On our big daddy. Big daddy polka dots. Where'd it go? Is T-Bone in the house? Still? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he's chilling right here by the front door. Yeah, we got to keep T-Bone in right now because the Barkers... The Barkers, y'all know the Barkers, the Barking Dogs next door. <coughs> one of them apparently is an escape artist too because one of them is running loose in the neighborhood and apparently no one can get a hold of the owners. So we're keeping T-Bone in. Um, they were trying to get him, they were trying to get get him, but he's, he's too skittish. And the way he barks, I wasn't getting too close to it. I wasn't taking no chances. I told Tim, I said, you don't get too close either. Because we don't have time for that. We ain't got time for that. We ain't got time for all that. We ain't got time for anyone getting injured. So um, one of the neighbors, I guess, was calling them to let them know that the dog was out. But I don't know. I never got any updates. So I don't know. I don't know. But they're not home yet. And it's been a couple hours. So we're keeping T-Bone in. Poor guy. We let him out for a little while. Yeah, see, Nancy says the monovision, the monovision is awesome. 
two different contacts. Your brain adjusts to it. No squinting involved. How long does your brain take to adjust to it, though? Well, that's right. We are talking about you. I, right. We are talking about this girl's this girl's little squirrel brain. Okay. I it's I don't know. I don't know how successful that would be. All right. What do we do? What do we do? That is not what you're wearing. Oh, you're staying here. Okay. Um, what do we do with this one? Do we do red and blue polka dots or what else do we do? Oh, maybe like little. So cute. Maybe. We could do stripes up and down. Oh, tall up and down stripes, red and blue, like alternate red and blue stripes. That would be there cute. Let's do that. Thank you, Elena. I'm awesome. I know. I know two different contacts, Jenny Day. It would drive me crazy too. I'm a crazy too. All right, so we're gonna go with some red and blue. Let me get a little bit more Hi. blue on my lid. Ooh, your air conditioning went out. Ooh, where do you live? Where do you live? I wish somebody would turn on our air conditioning. We don't need our air conditioning yet. Open <laughs> yeah. the windows. Nope, open the window. It's cool in the fan. evening. Yeah, fans and windows is what we got going on around here. Yes. Yep. All right. So we're just gonna do some stripes. So we'll start with blue. Elena. What? Blue. Come here. Like so. What? I'm gonna use two different brushes because I'm gonna alternate okay. it. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna do it. Hold on. I gotta shake this one up. I need to get to the paint. No, it's let me. Do you have a tear tray that you made fireworks no. for? A group of wood fire crackers, a cone fire, I have sprinkler, and something else. I missed the last part. Um, yes, because these would be super, super, super cute on a tear tray. Think of this every other, every other day. Super cute. And all my customers. All right. Except I Stripes. Right. And I'm not doing them perfect, y'all. They don't have to be perfect. Because have you ever looked at the firecrackers? They're not perfect. Okay? The papers are all squiggly and not lined up right. and They're not perfect. Yes, the foam is from Dollar Tree. Now I'm going to grab some names here in a second, guys. Oh, this brush is like a terrible brush. I don't know what's going on with it. It looks like it dried with paint in it or something. I don't know. It's like wild brush. That's okay. We're gonna make it work. Melissa says, "Does any of your do any of your kids uh, craft with you?" Elena will craft. Elena's pretty crafty. What? I, uh, I said that you are crafty. That you craft. Oh. Elena likes to paint. She does a lot of painting. She does, yes, she's. I do a lot of painting. She does a lot of painting. Yeah. And drawing. Good. Yep, painting and drawing. That's More so kind of, drawing though. She enjoys that the most probably. Yeah. Okay. Thank three. you, Penny, for the stars. I got three different drawing sketchbooks. They're all like half filled because I never finished a full book. But. All right, we got just a couple more. Hopefully my lines line up the way I want them to. If they don't, that's okay. We'll just hide that part in the back. Okay, if you okay. got a, a side that you don't like, hide it in the back. We have Fayette Miller Waxman, Debbie Craig Bottle, Billy Eddy, Brenda Stacks. Murphy, Melissa Bynum Young, Georgetta Clark, Close. Sally Van Horn, Kelly Dameron, Dad is amazing. Tina Drapo, Cheryl Miller, Pamela Manis, Cheryl Cranford. Hana Fire Blackman, hmm? Cynthia Street, and Jenny Roberts Day. All right, so we have the choice. We can paint up a little star and put a little star on it, or we could paint up a little tag and put like bang or something on it. Let me see what I have. Do I have another star to send someone if I do a star? These are from. Oh goodness. I think I got these in half. I think they're from Dollar General. Dollar General. Um, I'm pretty sure. It looks like a Dollar General thing. I think it's Dollar General. I know Tim got me a similar pack like this from Dollar General. Um, it wasn't this one. It was a different one. All right. I think I only have one star. Oh, no. We have two stars. We have two stars and two tags. So should we do, you guys, I'm going to let you guys decide. Hearts, if you think we should do a star. Thumbs up if you think we should do a little tag and write bang on it. Tim, watch, because I'm going to clean this up. What are we doing? Hearts for 
putting a little star, we're gonna do like a little, we're gonna tie them all together. And then we're either gonna put a tag, thumbs up for tag, hearts for a star. Scroll back. Where? Right there. You're saying what you were saying about your mom who bit who? I don't know. I don't know. Clarify that question. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. I don't think anyone bit anyone. I got a, sorry y'all, I got a phone call and I had to, I had to, I had to get rid of the phone call. Sorry, don't they know I'm live? Do I have to refresh now? Uh, it should just come back on. I'm back, I'm back, I'm here, don't leave me, I'm here both. Someone said both. Tim, were you watching? More hearts, I think? Yeah. I think it was more hearts. All right, so I want to distress no, these. Refresh. A wee little bit. Oh, let me dry this one a little bit. I want to distress them a little bit. I sew and do county cross stitch, trying to learn to do crafts. What I imagine what I want to craft is way better than how it turns out. Christine, that happens to a lot of people. Just keep practicing. Oh. Keep practicing. You know how many fails I've had? I've had so many craft fails throughout the years. Um, just keep trying. Just keep trying. Um, don't give up. Keep doing it. It's probably my computer. Close some of the windows. There's probably too many windows open. Well, once you try, you probably have to restart it. But I'll watch the comments over here. I want to do the chicken wire flag. What are the measurements? Um, I think it was a 12 by 12 frame, and I think we cut, if I remember correctly, I know I did say it in the video, though, so if you watch the video, um, you should be able to see it there. All right, so I'm going to dry this just to hear more. Um, that's that one, the chicken wire one. I think I cut it, it was more about the number of spaces. I cut 13 little octagon -y spaces, chicken wire spaces. And then I just used the length of the chicken wire, which I think was like 14 inches. Um, antique wax. Sorry, y'all, we lost our comments over there. Fiskar's hands, oh, that's my comment. You have taught me so many little tricks. Judy, I'm so glad to hear that. So glad. We're going to take our antique wax. We're going to take a baby wipe. This is my new favorite antique wax technique. It's like a two-step technique. Over my computer. I'm going to add just a little bit of shadowing with a little bit of antique wax. It's going to kind of make them look a little aged, a little old, a little here, a little there. Like so. So you just see some That's little good. shadowing. Kind of dirty it up a little bit. Make it a little dingy. Like so. Like so. Good. Especially around the edges. Yeah, what is going on with your computer? A little bit on the sides. Okay. Just, it's just a subtle touch, but I, I think it just adds so much. So it's like I went a little higher right there, and then I'll go a little shallower around the other edges. Make sure I get the ends a little bit. Do your wax melts ever do that thing where like they just stop making the scent? Yeah, wax melts lose their scent sometimes. Yes. That's so annoying. It's so annoying. It's so annoying. It is so I'm going annoying. To my computer. If you get too much antique wax, you can um, just wipe the excess off, okay? Just you wipe the excess that. off if you get too much. If you didn't get enough, you can add some more. And then step two is just take a stenciling brush. This one's a little bit big, but you can use any one. It can show that you can use what you have and I'm gonna put some on there, just dipping it right in the lid. And then I'm just gonna like get some of the extra off on my paper here, plate, whatever you got, get some of the extra off. And then you're gonna come back and you're just gonna kind of do like a stippling. 
So some areas have the shadowing, some areas have a little bit of a speckling. I just think it looks more natural that way. Like so. Like so. I might add a little more shadowing to this one. If you get too much, just dab some of the extra off. Like so. Hi. Is that what those brushes are for? This is not what these brushes are for. Oh. These are for using with stencils, but it works really well for I giving it a say, I never knew distressed, a distressed look. I was like, those are some weird brushes. Look. Yeah. And I'll hold it up for you in just a second. Did yours come back okay? Are you um, no, it didn't. Metal? No, I'm just making them look a little aged, a little vintage. A little exploded maybe already, just uh, a little bit. Oh, are they There's fireworks? They're gonna be firecrackers, yes. When I saw them, I pictured them as those like cement things at the boardwalk. The cement things at the boardwalk, the, the little pillars, that's what she was thinking. Cause see, our cement, the, the, um, the tie-offs for, what are they called? The tie-offs. No, not even those, the oh. ones that are like on the sidewalk that keeps the cars from in. Oh, like the parking lot pillars? <laughs> yes, we're making parking lot pillars. Well, no, that's oh, what it looks like. Pillars. Because ours are painted. Yeah. Yes, she thinks that because ours are painted all different fun um, There's themes. one that has a mermaid on it. There's one that has a mermaid. We have minion ones. Um, but up at the boardwalk, oh, yeah. we have the pillars with the little things that come out the side for the boats to tie off on. We have a like big ships will come in... Um, dock like the coast guard will come and dock on our docks the big tall ships will come and dock and um so we've got the big heavy duty ah, careful pillars but they're all painted they're all painted different themes it was something our town did they like opened it up to the public to submit to be able to like paint it and do something fun with it so um they're painted by all different artists from our community all right, so we're going to do the star. So we're going to use some Waverly Wax on the star. Like so. Brenda, I love when they look old, too. I love, okay. love, love, love a little bit of, like, loved and distressed goodness. Um, Elena probably is not cooking dinner tonight. I don't know what we're having for dinner tonight. Um, mm, chicken. Chicken. Tim says we're having chicken. Tim is having difficulties, yes. Tim is having technical difficulties. No, well, no, you are. It's your right. computer. So I used some antique wax for a little okay. star. We're going to dry that. I have a little star here that I'm going to send to someone. Along with the foam, whatever it's called that I used. It's called Craft Artisan Floor. It says it's floral foam, but it's like really, really stiff. And it's from Dollar Tree. All right. Now I'm going Please to... Please make some more patriotic crafts that can go outside. Oh, okay. Our distressed oxide. Tim can grab the list <gasps> for this. I know this is on the list because I just added it to the list. Um, but this is distressed, oh, ox distressed oxide. It's the rusty hinge one. And we're just going to... It's like a stamp pad, but we're just going to take our star and rub it on the corner of it. And now we have ourselves. That's how it looks now. Okay. And I'm going to take my stippling brush. We're just going to kind of add a little bit of the brown back. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. If you add too much, you can always add more of the distressed oxide. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Where'd you go there? And just kind of play with it until you get it the coloring that you want it. There we go. There we go. And now okay. we have a little rusty star. A little right. rusty star. That was just a little... Do you want that pin? A little wooden star. Yeah. All right. Okay. As as pin pinned it there well, so you guys can check it out. As soon as it posts, I'll pin it. Ooh, leftover stick and chicken, stick, chicken stuffing and gravy. That sounds yummy. Uh oh, what did I say? All right, 
So now, you probably said, gosh darn it, because that's what you say all the time. Yeah. Now, you, there's different things you can use for your little firecracker, firecracker thing, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to use, this is wire, this is like a burlap twine, a twine wrapped wire. Thank you, Gail, for the stars. You can get this at Dollar Tree. So I'm going to cut three pieces. One. So some, what is the distressing thing? It's an ink pad, but it looks like and rust. And color and link. Okay, it's... Tim just put the link there. It's, yeah, it's the pinned. rusty hinge is the one that I have. Rusty hinge. Rusty hinge. Rusty hinge. Sometimes when you cut your wire, you have to come Thank back you, and... Thank you, Fayette. Cut the... She says, left. I still got much Tim when he sneezed. Uh, I'll... Like he's really, like he really heard me. I heard you. All right. I heard you. I'm just gonna wrap it around a paintbrush, like so. And now well, thank we have you, Jenny. A cute little curly. Thank you for the 50 stars. Curly top. We need to attach it in here. Now this is kind of stiff. Welcome, Carol, and any other newbies we have. Welcome, welcome. We can try this barbecue skewer. Just to kind of get a get a hole started for it to help it out a little bit. Ooh, that sounds good, Trudy. Sure. Ham, green beans, and potatoes in the slow cooker. Ooh, that does sound good. All right, I'm making it a little bit bigger. I'm gonna put a tiny little dot of hot glue on there. Thank you, Nancy, for the stars. You guys, get ready. I'm gonna grab some names here. Teeny dot of hot glue. And then sticking it in the hole. I ordered that ink and they sent me the refill bottle. Oh. I would definitely contact them. Where I have I've had that happen where you order something and they send you the wrong thing. Yeah. We've definitely had that happen. How cute, how cute, how cute. So do the next one. So we're just, I hold it with my thumb. You can use a pencil, a pen, a Sharpie. Uh, paint handle like it just depends on how thick you want your your little curly cue how big around or how tight you want it what you wrap it around but this works well okay I, I got some names one. here we have Sue Yoder Nancy Ebston Rodriguez Alice King Angela Stachersky Jenny Roberts Day Missy Hubbard Shannon Johnson, Cynthia Street, Desi Mayo Coleman, Marcel Bilbo, Debbie Morgan, Gail McCaskin, and Terry Kopman Axtell. Okay. It was a little long, so I cut it a little bit shorter. So we have our little Thank second you, Rhonda, one. Thank you, stars. And now we're going to do this last one, and then we're going to attach them all together. Sure. Thank you, Janice, for sprinkling. Thank you, Sandy, for sprinkling. Thank you, Miss Darlene. Thank you, thank you. This one's definitely going to be too long, so I'm going to go ahead and trim it shorter now because I know it's going to be way too long. These are great. Thank you, uh, Bettina. Thank you. Yes, this is like the patriotic craft time of year, isn't it? Thank you, Leslie, for the stars. Oh. Well, thank you, Willie. Willie and Lynn. Uh, she says, Christy's Craft Room always has great tips. Aw, thank you. I try. I try. I try to bring you guys new and unique ideas of things to do and how to do it. All right, so there's our little one. So cute. So cute. So cute. Thank you, Cindy, so for the stars. Cute. All right, so now we're going to cluster them together. And you could um, glue them together. I don't think we really need to glue um, them. Deborah asked what we call the together. names for. I like that. So cute. You could actually use them just like this individually if you wanted to. But I'm going to cluster them as a little cluster. So I'm okay. going to take some we, different ribbons. We Go call ahead. the names for our crafty mail bucket. Twice a month, we will draw names. Uh, well, during, during the lives, for every hundred... This number goes up. My head. <laughs> That's my head. We, I'll grab some screenshots with names in it, and those will go into our bucket. And then twice a month, beginning-ish and middle-ish of the month, we'll, we'll pull a name out, and we will send that person 
Some good stuff. Some crafty mail. Some crafty mail. It's usually wood cutouts from our wood shop. Sometimes we throw some other stuff in there, but you usually get a big old box of um, wood cutouts that you can craft and create with. All right, so we got some twine. We've got some Rick Rack. I'm thinking, I, I have a lot. I think I have way more than I need. You think? I've got all the different twines, but I don't know if I'm going to use all that. I think I'm just going to use the oh. Rick Rack and the twine. And then the way you can, twine. the way oh, uh, the way you know is if you click that little follow button. That way you're notified when we post stuff on the page. Yes. You can know if you're the winner. All right. So I'm gonna just lay these down here, and I'm gonna tie them all together into a little bundle, like so. It's a little. Yeah, we got we got those. Uh, uh, about a month ago, the, the foam things, when we were at uh, yeah, we just got the them. big buck and a quarter store. Yep. But I will pick somebody at the end of this live who sprinkles this video to their friends. Um, <laughs> Diana Dury. My name is not hard, Tim. Um, Did I mispronounce it again? I will. You probably, yeah, you probably totally said the wrong name. Well, I, I do that sometimes. But I will pick somebody, and I'm going to send you the... Foam, the star, the twine, and the brick rack that I used, and some of the wire for the some of the wire for the little the little. Thank you, Sharon, for the stars. The igniters. Thank you, Jackie, for the stars. What are they called? The fuses. The fuses. Yes. Igniters. I feel like that's what I said. That is what you is said. Is that what I said? Right? They're kind of like yeah, igniters, no. aren't they? No, they're fusers. They need to be ignited. They're fusers. Thank you, Stephanie, okay, for the so stars. They're fusers? Fuse. Fusers? It's a fuse. I know. I thought you said fuser. No. Look at the, oh, cute. No. You could stop right there and be done. You could, you could, you could, but I feel like it needs the cute little rusty star <laughs> on the front because doesn't every patriotic craft doesn't need a rusty star? Doesn't everything a rusty star? Every patriotic craft needs a rusty star. Come on. Tell me that's not true. Tell me that's not true. You can tell me, but I'm not going to believe you, okay? I'm still going to add a rusty star to all my patriotic crafts. I actually, I actually think I need to add a little more rust to this. I think I'm going to come up to my fuses here and just add a little. It would be easier to do this first. Thank you, Jenny, for the stars. But we'll just add a little here, a little there. Team Rusty Star, is that what they said? I'm Team Rusty oh, yeah. Star. Oh, well, Team Rusty Star. Yes, Team Rusty Star wins every time. Every time, every time. Right, let me get this bottom part, and then I'm going to hold it up and show y'all. Oh. <laughs> Shelly says, I just ordered rusty starters from Amazon last night. Okay, I'm going to actually pull this little igniter out, and then a little bit. so Because I, I can't, I'm going to pull it out. Boy, that glue really, like, held it in. Jeez, old Jiminy Crickets. I need to do a new one. I need to do a new one, because I, I couldn't get, it was too little, and I couldn't get to the <laughs> rustiness of it. Trudy. She says, Tim, maybe it's good you don't or uh, call my name for the crafty bucket M70 and we'll probably have a heart attack. <laughs> Who was that? Tr Miss Trudy. Miss Trudy. Miss Trudy. They are so funny. All right. So now I can rest it. This is the easiest way to do it. Oh, Cindy says, die no mind. Die no mind. Yes, ma'am. Add my rest before. Phyllis said she thinks they're called wicks. Could be a wick. I think wick is a good... A could good, be a wick. A good name for you. it. It's a little too long, so cut it. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Watch your eyeballs, y'all. Watch your eyeballs. Whoa! These, I told rust you we're going to make a bang. These things are a little explosive. Tina little says explosive. rust makes everything better but your car. I know, right? Right? We want everything rusty but our car. I know. Unless it's a good old little um, red, red old pickup truck. I feel like a little rust might be okay. No, then it's called patina. Then it's called patina. Yes. <laughs> yes. True. All right. I'm going to kind of curl my wires, you, make that, it not so perfect. With that uh, uh, distressed oxide, can you tap a brush on it and then... You can. We actually it? did that with one of our other crafts. I forget what I used. I think I used... 
I think I used a paintbrush and got some on the brush. I mean, it's, 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 you gotta really get it in there and get some on your brush good, but you can, you can, um, you can. Cause we did that, I don't know, last week on something we made, y'all. How stinking cute. Teresa, that's the, uh, are these distressed How oxide cute? rusty hinge. Yes, Tim put the link there. He pinned it there. It's pinned at the bottom in the comments for you. But how cute is our little firecracker? Cynthia, the weather is beautiful Bundle. here right now. It's, uh, I think it's like mid-60s and sunny. Gorgeous. All right, so someone is going to get, last chance, sprinkle, sprinkle, spread the love. Someone is going to get this foam that we used, this star, I need to get you some Rick Rack. I'm going to give you a little bit of an extra long piece just in case. Just in case. Some of the blue Rick Rack. And the Rick Rack is from Hobby Lobby. It's Hobby Lobby has their, um, I need to get there. They have their, um, oh, whatever it's called, ribbon 50% off right now. So these are only 99 cents, guys. 99 cents. And you get so much more than you get cent. at some of the other places that sell ribbon, okay, that we like to buy from. Um, you get a lot. You get uh, three yards instead of nine. Well, I guess oh, I guess it's about the same because usually you get nine feet. But it's really good quality. All right, so we're gonna get you some some twine. We're oh, coming to the end of this twine. Ah, knocking over my firecrackers. Way to go. What else did we use, guys? Am I missing something? Oh, you need some. You need some of this. Goodness, so let me cut you a chunk of this wire that we used from Dollar Tree. Uh-oh, y'all, we lost you for a second. Did we? All right. All right, so somebody is going to get all this. Is that everything? That's everything. You got the rusty star? I got the star. I can't send the paint and the distressed oxide, but you can you can use what you got, okay? Um, but, yeah, so Tim is going to pick a um, name, all right? He's going to randomly scroll through the comments, and I'm going to not look. I'm going to tell him when to stop, and the first name he sees that shows on our end that you shared it, that he is going to say that name, and you send us a private message with your address, okay? So, you ready, Tim? Yep. Go ahead. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Keep those names up rolling. Stop. Stop them fast this time. I'm In the big. name of love. I know, Terry, that distress oxide is awesome. Before you break my heart. Your daughter wants to make this Think awesome. Think it Rita. over. Thank you, Miss Cheryl, for sprinkling. <laughs> Maria, Maria says, I am ready. Let's shop for the goods. All right, who we got? Who we got? Who we got now? Who Miss. We got, who we got? Who we got now? I feel like I feel like this person won recently. So see, you can win more than once. I could be wrong. But I feel like she may have won something very fairly recently. So see, it can happen. It can happen. You can win more than once, okay? Really? I'm pretty sure. I feel like Miss Deborah Danielson. Did you just win something? I feel like you just won something. But girlfriend, that's okay. You're still qualified. You win it again. You win it again. See what happens? You stick around. You comment. You interact. You switch air. You do all the things. And it can happen more than once, okay? You need to go buy yourself a lotto ticket, girlfriend. Miss Deborah Danielson. Are you here? Are you here still? Um, let us know. Did you win something recently? I feel like you did. I feel like you did. How exciting. Exciting. All right. What is the item number for the Rick Rack? I looked online but couldn't find it. Um, oh, good Lord. They write these so small. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, 474-312. Oh, 474-312. Four, awesome. four, 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 What'd you say? All she said was awesome. Whoop, whoop, Deborah, whoop. did you did you win something before? I might not have oh, caught up yet. I did. It was the bunny sign. The bunny sign. See, I had a feeling. All right, so the number for the blue is 474-312. 474-312. And the number for the red is, grab your pen, 471-599. 471-599 for the red. Rick Rack. Um, if you missed it, we're gonna pop off here. You come back and fast forward to this part in the replay and um, check it out and be ready with your pen. Okay, all right guys, well we're gonna hop off of here. One last little peek at our cute little um, firecrackers. 
great for a tiered tray, perfect for a tiered tray. Um, that's where mine's gonna go. So I'm gonna hop off here. I have a track meet I gotta get out the door to. So I love you guys. Thank you guys for hanging out with us. Rick Rack, hard to find, um, used to be so popular, hard to find. Hobby Lobby has an assortment of colors. They have mustard yellow, they have gray, they have green, they have I pink, they have blue. white, they have blue, they have red, they have a ton of colors. They have black, um, so definitely check Hobby Lobby for it. They have all the colors. All right, guys. Love you guys. Have a great day. We'll see you later. Have fun, guys.